In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys the best way to get talent tokens in Anime Champion Simulator. So guys, here we are on Anime Champion Simulator. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys the best method in the game right now in order to get yourself talent tokens extremely, extremely fast, guys. By using this method, you can get yourself up to 1,000 of these per hour, which is absolutely crazy, guys. I literally just used this method for like two minutes before recording the video, and I had zero, and now I've got 40, guys. It's absolutely crazy how many of these you guys can go in and get. So make sure you guys do watch all the way up until the end without further ado. Let's go on in. Before I start anything off, though, guys, I'm going to be giving away some stuff in the store if you guys do want anything in the shop right now all you guys need to do like the video subscribe to the channel comment down below your roblox username three simple steps you need to take to enter why not it's completely free to do so let's now go on into the videos so how do you guys get these fast well first of all guys you go ahead and get these talent tokens from the magic spirits that spawn around the game now guys keep in mind these do not only spawn in this world that i'm in right now they can spawn in hero academy ninja village bizarre bizarre demon forest they can spawn in all worlds guys now the thing is, some worlds are better for finding them than others. Now what is the best world for finding these spirits in guys? Well that is the pirate town. And I'll show you guys why in a second. Now, pretty much guys, the reason why pirate town is the best is that this map is really, really small. They only spawn in this bottom area over here, in here, and behind the cannons. So I'm going to be showing you guys every single spot in pirate town that they do spawn in, to keep in mind. Um, wait, is this, is this pirate town? It is pirate town. Yeah, I want to be showing you guys every spot in pirate town that they spawn. And I'm going to be showing you guys a route that you can take and repeat around the game where pretty much guys you're always going to find some of these as you do in this loop. Now um, I'm going to be showing you guys all the locations right now in this place and I'm going to be showing you guys what I personally do in order to find all of these. So pretty much guys there will be a location right behind this market stand just right now. There's also going to be a location just around here. Um, there will be another one that can spawn just in this corner right now. Then guys, if we go ahead and go up here, there'll be another one that can spawn right around here. And there's also one that can spawn just behind this area. Next guys, you can potentially find another one that's right behind this, uh, right back this corner right now where my mouse is. Um, after that, if we go ahead and go over here, there's one that can spawn out in this area and there's one that spawns behind this too. There's also another one that spawns right here guys, as you can see. So let's claim up that one. There we go, nice and easy. We've already got one in this video today. There's also another one that spawns behind these boxes. After that, guys, you can find another one that spawns just in this gap right now. And finally, guys, you'll find some more that just spawn. Um, well, the one spawns behind here, guys. So, yeah, that's all the locations. So there's like, maybe I'd say like 10 in total. Now, the question is, how do you find them fast? Well, of course, guys, what you can do is go ahead and dash you guys can dash around the map in order to find these fast but personally what i recommend you guys to do go ahead and watch my mount video or my how to fly video guys and you'll be able to unlock a flying mount now this is what i personally do right now guys and this is the fastest way now mounts guys actually have 10 extra speed other than your walking speed which is really really fast so i recommend a quick mounts and this is what i personally will do i will literally use this flying mount in order to do this loop around the map guys and literally i can easily just scan through every single area right now in this without having to like follow the paths directly meaning that i can get around the map a lot faster there we go guys we got that one over there so yeah guys this is by far the fastest way of doing it so get yourself a mount guys and you can just fly around the map as you guys can see i've completed one loop right now so i'm gonna go again see if i can find anything nothing out um nothing over there nothing over here guys um nothing back there there's there's one guys there we go so as you can see we are finding these really really fast right now so nothing behind there so as you guys can see it seems like only one of these um like magic spirits spawn in at once or at least guys like two spawn in at one time so you kind of need to be careful about that so um once you guys find one then essentially there might not be any more on your loop however guys i would still loop around because you never know another one could spawn potentially back in however guys as you can see here all i'm doing is repeating this process is going around the map guys and every single time i go ahead and do this i am pretty much yeah, there we go guys there's another one i'm gonna find another one of these spirit things which is quite cool guys they literally spawn it in really really quickly guys and i'm finding a bunch right now i've literally got 12 and that's just with me explaining this as well guys i could go go a lot faster right now and of course guys we've not been lucky enough to find any of the golden ones if you guys find a golden one honestly guys it is so much better because they give you guys like a lot more so i definitely would recommend that as you guys can see we just found another one back here we're now on a good 15 
already found, which is nice and easy, guys. And we're flying through this. Now I can kind of cut these corners and just, I guess, um, explore the map just like this, guys. And we're absolutely flying right now. There's there's another one. So as you guys can see already, this video, um, I'd probably say we've just been doing this loop for maybe like two minutes right now. And already, guys, we've got ourselves like 18 in two minutes which is kind of crazy guys and my first loop that i've done in like three minutes before the video where i got a lot i actually found two of the golden ones guys so the golden ones really do increase your i guess speed of finding these by a bunch so definitely guys you're going to want to focus on trying to get them golden ones because they'll help you guys out a lot but as you guys can see here we're absolutely flying and this is by far of course the best map to do this in as it's really really compact now of course guys i could show you all the locations in the other maps but personally guys i honestly would only do this one this is by far the quickest method of claiming these up so you yeah, guys do not move from this map as if you guys do then of course um i guess um you won't get them as fast guys and that's pretty much the fastest method right, method right now it's going to do and get these talent tokens we're now on 64 which is crazy guys and we can find so many more of this but definitely the guys if you cannot fly already um, you guys are going to want to get this mount because honestly, as you can see, this mount increases them by so much. Increases the speed of finding these by, I'd probably say 50% guys, because we don't need to follow the path, which of course slows you down a little bit more. And you can kind of just cover more distance in general and have a little look throughout more distance, um, which makes this a lot, a lot quicker and easier. Um, and yeah, honestly, guys, we're absolutely flying right now. Yep, there's another one. So, already, guys, one six more right now, which is crazy. Um, and that's essentially, guys, the best method right now in order to go and get these um, talent tokens in the game. Now, keep in mind, guys, if you want to go and get yourself an S tier champion, I'm actually going to be making a video after this one showing you guys exactly how you can get S tier champions really, really easily because it's quite hard, guys, if you don't know about this really, really secret tip that I'm going to be discussing later on. However, guys, yeah, that's essentially how you can get these talent tokens fast. And of course, guys, you can then use these to roll and get yourself some good traits on your characters. However, guys, I think that's going to be it for this video here. Um, as always, guys, whenever this game does update, I'm going to be the first person to show you guys how to complete all the um, all stuff in this game. So make sure you guys do, of course, like and subscribe for more.